Hi, in today's video, we'd like to demonstrate the Navix Apple CarPlay and Android Auto solution for the 2010 to 2011 Mercedes E-Class. If you have a different Mercedes or a different vehicle, please make sure to go to Navix.com and see our other solutions for your particular car. To access the CarPlay function, you're going to hold and press the back button. We've already connected the iPhone using wireless. It can also be connected wired. Android Auto works with the wire only at the moment. All functions are going to be controlled using the factory jog wheel and the clear button. So let's go to Vase. Let's change the view. Let's zoom out. You see the big picture? There we go. So we get to see all of these icons. Okay. Let's go to Google Maps. Let's change the view on Google Maps. Let's play audio. Let's ask Siri for help first. Siri, can you show us the closest Dunkin' Donuts? We can always ask Siri for help. Let's play audio. There's the music. Now we're going to take you to Android Auto. So let's get out of CarPlay. We've connected our Android phone. There we go. It's already in Google Maps. So let's um, change the view on Google Maps. We'll show you vase. There's vase. Let's ask OK Google for help. Please show us the closest Dunkin' Donuts. Let's play music. Let's go to YouTube Music. There's YouTube Music. So besides Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, this unit can also be used to add a backup camera if you don't have one. And you can also use this to play video and music from a USB storage device. So we're gonna go ahead and connect a USB thumb drive and play a video file to demonstrate this.